Welcome to Tucson Dragway in beautiful Tucson, Arizona. Here comes Steve Huff and his electric dragster, the final pass of the night, and he is chasing history. Steve looking to do something special. The all-time electric dragster run is held by Big Daddy Don Garlitz at 189 miles an hour. Steve is coming off a career best of 185 miles an hour, his first full pull at this test session. This will be the last run of the night. It's late, it's past midnight. And it looks like the team's having a problem right now. Taller tire went up quicker. Really? The stiffer tire. 6.75. Clear, go backwards. So the team increased the tire pressure to 6.75. That caused the car to shut off due to an over rev. They've corrected the problem. They reset the system. And Steve Huff now, with his final attempt, is going to try to better his 185 mile an hour career best pass. It sounds powerful, it looks powerful. Some very smart men from AEM Electronics are here. They were able to dial it in with the laptop and increase power by 10% from the last run. We also know during the last run, Steve had to lift at about 1,100 feet due to the car getting out of shape. They're hoping the increase in tire pressure is able to cure that problem. One, there oh! it is, history, 752, 201. <laughs> 201. 201. 201. Oh, 201, man. Oh, my God. Oh, dream realized. Wow. Man, congratulations. How about it? <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, this is awesome. Man, we were hoping for anything in the oh. 190s. How fulfilling is this? This is awesome. 10% more got us 201. It's unbelievable. Put a little more air Just in those tires. A little more power in there. Tempo more. Oh a little bit more God. air on the tires. A little taller. This is awesome. Just a slight change. 201 from 185 to 201. Congratulations. Wow. Exactly the same as the rocket bike. 201. Yeah. Truly amazing. <laughs> that's that's Steve going crazy in the car. You, you'll see him in the pits. Steve this is awesome. Let's give you one more look. Two oh one. Exactly the same. Wow, even the eighth was slow. I was surprised. He picked it up on the top end. He stayed in it. He stayed in it. He gained 40, 45, a little over 46 miles per hour. Oh my gosh. On, from the, that's amazing. Thanks for putting my name What is your name, sir? <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it. Matt. Matt, Tucson Dragway yes. just made history. How's Absolutely. that feel? Badass. If I can say that, why not? Yeah. That's badass. I think you'll be okay. Great to see, awesome evening. Congratulations, guys. Yeah. Awesome. 752, 201 miles an hour. Let's go down and catch up with Steve. Oh my goodness, Steve, you did it! You did it, congratulations! Wow, wow. Steve, that was out of nowhere. We all thought if you could get to 190 miles an hour, it would be mission accomplished today. 201! You are the first. What was the ET? What was ET? 753. <laughs> We're just pulling, making power. We'll get that 60 down tomorrow. A bit uh, until we get the clutch, though. We, we won't be running deep into the sixes, but I think we can get it. To, uh, we, we we have 10 percent more power. We get to put in tomorrow. First pass, 180. What? 185. 185. 760. 185. 
uh, we needed a little more spray at the big end of the track. I was skating all around on that, on that 185 pass. I had to lift. We were, uh, GPS had us at 1,000 feet. Um, at or 1,100 feet, we were at 188. And then I pedaled it a couple of times, so it was moving towards the wall. And then this pass, they went out, they gave me some fresh spray for the track. And, uh, and we added some more power to it. We're turning, this is only the second pass, man. We're, we haven't even started. And uh, the battery's doing amazing, everybody. And then uh, I thought maybe that was a 190, 195 or so. And then I heard Derek over the radio, two, one. I didn't barely understand what, but I heard two. <laughs> and all so I heard the radio doc. I said, what you say? Amazing. <laughs> from this end, it was noticeable. Oh, What'd that man. feel like on the top end? Was it moving around again? No, no, no. It's, just, it's fine. I mean, if it doesn't move around a little, you should try a little harder. I mean, you just got to stay in the throttle, and you got to be able to stop these cars before the sand pit. And, uh, uh, you know, you do those two things, and uh, you focus a long ways down the track. You don't do it at nighttime. It's a little more challenging, but... Um, you know, what the hell, man, that's what we're, we're here to race. That's, so I've been doing this for a long time. And, uh, uh, you just got to put your head back against that roll cage and let her rip, let her eat, man. Let her eat. Steve, uh -oh. only that's one, it. only one guy can be first. You are now yeah! first, <laughs> the first electric dragster racer to reach 200 miles an hour. <laughs> uh. How fulfilling is this? I know you've worked midnight, so hard. When the track was closing, it was our last pass. Man, it was midnight. It was, yeah, it was 12 right now. I, 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 as I was going past through the shutdown, I gave a thumbs up to that. I didn't even hear the written the number yet. I hadn't heard it, and I see the, the security guys, the ambulance guys, I gave them a thumbs up and waved them off because we're closed. We had the track till midnight. We made the hit at midnight. Yes! <laughs> yes! And thank you, Jack. Cycle Jack, man. I, thank you. I mean, I'm happy to this. This I'm happy bad. to be a part of it. We've been oh. following this for a long time, and I hate to say it, but there is uh, one man in Ocala, Florida. I think you might have just broke his heart, Big Daddy Don Garlitz. Hey, Don Garlitz, man. Uh, hey, there's two things I have to do. First, um, none of this, none of it would be possible without Larry Carroll uh, at all. Uh, he's uh, he's had faith in my crazy ideas, and he's stuck with me in these years. And, um, we've always improved, man. And uh, Larry, I, I gotta thank you. Without you, this wouldn't happen. Uh, you know, I'd just be some crazy dude with a bunch of dreams and uh, you know some good ideas. And uh, they can copy our ideas all they want, but uh, you'll never beat anybody if you copy them. Uh, you got to come up with good ideas. Uh, Don Garlitz, you were the king of great ideas, man. This car's, uh, my, all my chassis are transfers built from your old Sidewinder. You inspired me when I was a young man, when I was a child, when I was a young man. And as an adult, it was Don Garlitz uh, when I heard, first heard of this uh, Quest for 200. And uh, that was in uh, at the end of 2016. And uh, I started on the car in 2017. And um, it's been a hell of a road, man. Uh, but Don, thank you uh, for inspiring me and so many others. And, you know, it's a bittersweet because, I, uh, you know, as competitors, we want to win. But, uh, you know, you hate beating, or not, you know, you hate beating your hero to the punch. Uh, but well, I tell you, it's because of my team, Derek Barger. Uh, Derek Barger, the guys at AEM that made this four motor thing possible for me. Um, you know, Reinhardt, uh, Chris Brune, uh, Reinhardt Motion Systems. Uh, Chris Brune, uh, you know, he's been stuck in, hung in there with us. We've gone through a few motors. These motors that we have from, from uh, Five Power, mind boggling. Um, but Derek Barger, I mean, Derek, I mean, right there on the car, it says Carol Huff and Barger. And uh, without Derek, uh, well, I couldn't do it. Um, Derek's taught me so much. And he's the battery guy. Anybody in the industry knows he's the battery guy. Asian, I got a race for you, brother. Uh, Dawn, I'm still down to race, man. I, I'd love to. And uh, I just want to meet you, shake your hand, and say hi. Uh, uh, I look forward to it. And, yeah, there's only one first. And, uh, uh, Mr. McBride, uh, me and you, looks like right now, the only two that have gone over 200, both gone 201. What was, what was uh, Larry went 201? God, I'll have to go back. Yeah, uh, now we're so close. Yeah, I don't know what that was down to. Maybe we'll decimal. set up that match race yeah, one I'll of these days. I'll tell you what, there you go, Larry. <laughs> You will break that old bike back out, and uh, I'll bring the old hot rod here, and um, we'll go do something. But this goes back to teachers of mine like Jim McClure and Alan Sputh. Uh, I mean, this goes back to high school, man. My shop teacher, Mark Racico, of my uh, 
you know, every all these old boys on on South Whidbey Island that, uh, you know, they just they taught me how to think and um, always told me to just never give up. And uh, uh, with this COVID thing going on and everybody not having a great time, none of us are. But we had to drive all the way to Tucson to get this done. And uh, but I, I I just I have to like thank Larry and Carol and the whole Carol family. I mean they. They've all made sacrifices to get this thing here. And uh, my team has made more sacrifices than I can count. My, uh, my, my girlfriend has, I mean, this is the whole thing. My friends, my customers at my shop. Uh, fuck, we did it, man, we did it, brother. We did it, and uh, thanks again, Don. And the quest for 200 is done. Uh, now the quest for 250. Uh, uh, and I hope that this, oh I, I hope no. that this inspires, uh, you know, hopefully this, this uh, you know, inspires another new group of young racers or yeah. new racers. Let's see more of these electric tracksters. Uh, you know, if we can, if there's, we've always been around to help, um, you know, I've got some cars that we do, rider de driver development and some motorcycle stuff, you know, with a great rider. My team, my, the flood guys, hydroplane, uh, you know, we're sitting out right now. But that, that boat's ready to go back out and kick some butt right where we left off last season. Our super hooligan team is in first place with David Colstead riding. Uh, you know, when we get back to racing, he's going to be further in first place. Uh, this car, AEM, we have to say thank you. Uh, Anti-gravity batteries, I have to say thank you. Uh, um, of course, Reinhardt, um, uh, Reinhardt and the Five Power, and just everybody that's helped along the way. I mean, there's so many people. I, I can't. I, I wasn't ready. I thought we were gonna do this tomorrow, buddy. <laughs> we did we it. Do we did it. You had the track uh, till midnight. Day. How cool were these guys at Tucson? Twelve oh five, I think it a, was. We made four passes today. We made a hundred foot, a three a three thirty pass, an eighth mile pass. Um, said, all right, let's uh, drive it through the lights. Uh, you know, like I said, that one was a uh, seven sixty five, uh, one eighty five, which was you know personal best and it raised the AC record. Uh, and then, uh, uh, and then I, I made a call to put a f another pound and a quarter in the tires. It was pretty wholesale. That was a change. good call. That was That's a good a call. Change. Uh, so I put in another pound and a quarter in there, and uh, we got some new spray at the big end. And you know, she drove like a dream. Uh, drove like a dream. Stopped. I tell you this. This isn't a three-quarter mile shutdown. What the hell were those guys talking about? This is about. <laughs> uh, a solid third of a mile, but uh, we got to stop. No, no problem. Everything works great. And uh, I'm going to take this back. Come on, let's go to the pit. I think there's a bottle of champagne waiting for us. Let's uh, toast it, man. How Thank about you, man. it? How about it? Uh, <laughs> uh, Woo! You better fucking watch bastard. it. Huh? What? Where are you? Where are you? Okay. Huh? Oh, ready? Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. All right. All right. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, yeah, baby! Woo! <laughs> 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 Let's see if you can do it. Yeah! 201. Woo! Yes! <laughs> this stuff's horrible. Where's the Coors Light? <laughs> History was made indeed. Congratulations, Steve Huff. And make sure you are subscribed to Cycle Drag on YouTube and you like CycleDrag.com on Facebook because we have a full length, in depth video coming that will show you this day from start to finish. But as for now, Steve Huff. The first to 200 miles an hour in the electric dragster. Congratulations. It was a day to remember, that's for sure. These guys have been after this milestone for years. So gratifying, so fulfilling. Please join me in congratulating Steve Huff on this historic achievement. Much more coming. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope we provided you with a little bit of entertainment. That's always what we aim to do. We love motorcycles. You love motorcycles. Let's keep this thing growing. Check it out, guys. Up here on the wall, 
100,000 subscribers. I love it. Thank you so much. It's all because of you. We appreciate it. Please come with any story ideas. We love the comments and the feedback. I read every single one of them. The positivity is always appreciated. And you haters out there, I love you too because you keep me on my toes. Thank you for watching no matter what. Guys, to keep this thing growing, please subscribe to Cycle Drag on YouTube. Hit the bell for notifications. Share it with some friends who like drag racing, like motorcycles. This is how we can keep this thing going. And also like cycledrag.com on Facebook and we'll keep rolling, we'll keep finding those stories, we'll keep finding those impressive high performance motorcycles that you want to see. Thank you guys so much, truly appreciate it. You know if there's anything fast motorcycles involved, we are in. Cycle Drag goes on. Fast motorcycles or fast electric dragsters, you never know what you'll see. Make sure you're subscribed to Cycle Drag, like, share, like CycleDrag.com on Facebook. A full length video will be coming. Stay with us.